Yo guys, what's up? It's Danny from Danny and Vinny's Days, and you know, I was just on Google searching up online Bibles, and then I came across this video called Letter to My Future Husband. You know, I, I wasn't sure if I was going to do it, but uh, you know, I have no other choice. It's so cringy. You know, it makes me want to reconsider life on this earth. Let's watch it. Dear Future Husband, How you be? How you doing? I don't know if I've met you yet. Maybe I have. But I trust that you're still being prepared through God to deal with me. So you take your time. I'm some like next level blessing. Seriously. Why does it look like she's sweating? Did she just run a mile on a treadmill or something? And what did she say? Some next level what? If you guys understood that, please write in the comments what she said. Uh, I don't I don't understand, idiot. I bet you're gonna be super, super goofy. And even if your jokes suck, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna laugh at them anyway, so it's okay. Why would you laugh at something that isn't funny? Is your cerebral cortex broken? Is your brainstem snapped in half? Because if it is, that's a major, like, you're gonna need some surgery. I'll bring you to a doctor, I mean. Just hit me up. I wonder if you'll be my total opposite. Maybe you'll be good at everything that I'm not, you know, like... Like making YouTube videos, drinking bleach, etc, etc. You know, sports, math, getting out of bed, working out, and... Oh, cooking. Yeah, definitely cooking. I wonder if you're gonna have a big heart for people. I hope you're not only patient with me, but that you will join me in my shenanigans. If I ever have a wife like this, I'm begging you. I'm praising the lords and saviors. Please, strike me with a bolt of lightning so my brain stops working. Watch out, I like pranks, and I'm not a big fan of losing. Whether you speak Portuguese already or not, you're gonna have to learn. You're gonna have to know enough to tell my mama that you love her food and that you brought flowers for her. <laughs> Who speaks Portuguese? In my whole 17 years of living, I've never heard anyone ever speak Portuguese. Going to be the key to your success. Seriously, the key. My favorite part will be watching how you honor God as first in your life. You should just marry Jesus Christ. You're obsessed with him. And what if this guy is an atheist and he just worships the devil in your basement? You will never know. And trust me, I'm far from perfect. But until you come into my life, I'll keep praying for you and for your relationship with the Father Almighty. Oh, and I can't wait to travel together, to do God's work together, get a golden retriever and name him Bobby Jr. Yeah, I'll, I'll explain that later. I do think her cerebral cortex is destroyed because she's laughing at jokes that aren't even funny, just like she said. I mean, look in the background. I'll play something. Hold up. I mean, if you ask me, I think she's pretty satanic. I mean, did you not hear the background music while she was laughing? I didn't even put that there. That was in the video. Yeah, I said good luck, so there you go. And I can't wait to enjoy all the blessings and lessons of this life as one. And I have no doubt that you're going to be worth the wait, because my God has said, Blessed is she who believes that the Lord will fulfill his promise to her. So don't worry, I'll wait. Oh no, it's, it's not patience. I'm just stubborn. You know what else Jesus Christ said? He said, And I will make them eat the flesh of their sons and the flesh of their daughters, and all shall eat the flesh of their neighbors in the siege and in the distress with which their enemies and those who seek their life afflict them. Jeremiah 19.9 Basically saying, You're gonna have to eat your children. <laughs> That's pretty much the end of the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and share the video. You know, 
our channel is always growing. It's been growing fast lately. I know I say it every video, but thanks a lot, guys. I really appreciate it. Peace.